But at the same time, you know, I don't want her to be sick. Good. All that's left is to begin the ritual. Do it. Need anything? See you later. Night embrace you. Light bless you. Take care. In nature. Who are you? Are one. Visions of the dreamer's origins. The nightmares may not be real, but they can still hurt you. Be careful. They may not be real, but they're real to your mind. In which case, you will die. Oh. Sorry, you have to scream louder to cat to get her to, you know, behave. Yo. A dear friend's betrayal. A pain that never fades. How is this possible? Hey, get down from there right now. Get down. No. Down. Man, I'm really going to have to put her in that kennel because she's acting crazy and I don't want her to open those sutures. And also, I don't want her to make a mess. You know, that that's important too. Okay, I need to really... No, you're going in the kennel. No. You're acting too crazy. You're supposed to be taking a break to relax from your surgery. Come here. No, no, no. You need to relax. Oh, man. It's like she's acting so crazy. Like, I can't let her play with the other cats because her little thing is still... Like, her fur is still not there from when they did the surgery. And my bigger cats play with her like she's the same size as they are. And I don't want there to be any complications, so... For the greater good, I have to put her in her little kennel. Just because I don't want her to get injured in any way. I do it because I love my cat. Sometimes you have to make decisions that seem like horrible choices, but you're doing it because you love them, not because you hate them. You do it because you don't want her little sutures to open up, you do it because you want her to heal. It must be done. Oops. So much left unfinished. So much remorse and regret. 
I mean, really, what did she do, though, other than, like, die? She never stopped the cataclysm, I guess, or whatever she was planning on doing, she didn't do it. Guess she thought she had infinite amounts of time. Now we have to play as Isera. Spoilers! We have to play as Isera. She's getting killed by adventurers. Kind of how this happened with Illidan, where you play as him against raiders. It begins again. The pain and agony. The madness beyond measure. Yeah, I'll admit I cried at the end of this quest line when it was relevant content. I remember I got pissed because somebody had spoiled. Like, they didn't necessarily say what happened. All they said was, oh man, the end of... Uh, what was it? The end of Valshara is, like, so sad. And then I'm like, you know, like, spoilers, like... I'm already expecting there to be a sad ending, which is kind of lame. I must abandon my beloved. So my beloved. And it's like the other person's like, oh, the thing with the dragon. And it's like, okay, people are just being fucking annoying. So this is why, like, I don't really do guilds. It really didn't matter anyway, because, like, that person, you know... If I remember correctly, that person didn't even stay in the guild. Do what you must do. The so they were a troublemaker anyway, but it was like, I don't blame. Oh! And it's like, you know, I don't need like toxic pieces of shit in my life. I'm just trying to enjoy the fucking game. And there are Hello. people who... Death Knight minus 859. And there are people who just fuck it up Welcome. just because they have nothing going for them other than being Float a nuisance. Haste Mastery, very nice. It is now time to revive the spirit or whatever. Use the Droma's Horn to summon the Wild Hunt in the interest of the Grove. The horn. Who are you? Sound the call and summon the hunt. You could probably use a little but it's like, okay, I'm already expecting something sad is going to happen, which is like, lame. I want to not have to expect anything because, um, possessed by slain. Oh, this one always takes... Your is at hand. Time. But it's like, yeah, I know, it's not like a major spoiler, like, it's not necessarily like, oh, they didn't tell me that Isara, or Isara gets killed. Your demise is at hand. It's like, I know it's a Sheldon Cooper type moment where, now I'm going in pre-hyped up. It's not really that, it's just like, telling me if something sad happens is like, well, shit, now I know something sad is going to happen, and I can already start to guess what it is. Oh, does it? Yo! Touch it There's two of them in this one. It's a minor nitpick, I know. But, like, fucking... Spell not learned, what do you mean? It's just like, not cool. It also kind of lets you know like when you're getting to an end of a zone. If like, oh, Isara gets possessed. Wait, somebody told me something sad happens. Oh, I can see how this ends. Like, it doesn't take a genius to see that. 
but you know, that's just how I felt about it. It was it was sad. I still got sad about it, but Welcome That's because you spent a lot of time with the Sarah and Valshara. So they did a character death well in that way. Like I'll talk whenever we did our Tales of the Abyss playthrough where like Ion dies and it's really fucking sad. You spent a good chunk of the game with him and got to know him as a character. That does not bode well. No, hun, I'm not gonna let you out. No, hun. I need your wounds to heal, hun. And the piece of paper said, keep exercise to a minimum or whatever, not to let you run around and jump around, so. What the? Oh no, that's inside. I'd rather you be sad about being in your kennel than you being physically in pain. They did not heed the call. How strange. In nature, all are one. Find Hunt Captain Karain on the path of rebirth. Can uh, could you like stop talking to me? Thank you. How rude. I see your hunt goes well, mortal. Um, you didn't answer the call, so that's why I came here. Lorcron is here. Reach Droman Alioc in Hibernal Hollow or Alioc. Glory to the wild hunt. Wild hunt with me. For Ardenweald. Don't you see? It was a trap. They wanted us to be drawn out. You know. Welcome to my grove. Win the battle for our Pernal Hollow. Yeah, that's totally doable. Aim true and strike down our prey. Twenty attackers. Yeah, see, you don't get experience for these dudes, so it's kind of like annoying. Just a little annoying. It would be too good if you got experience from them, I guess. Yo! Ow, dude fucking hit me hard. I like how they're not even fighting each other. Anymore. Oh wait, oh, camera's on, gotta do something. Ow, oh, who hit me with something that really hurt? Okay, I need to kill this one. Oh my god, oh my god, I'm... I have something in my bags. Where is it? I don't fucking have this shit. That could have been dangerous. This annihilator's been getting on my last damn nerve. Um, hmm. 
Whoa! Talking about an instant respawn. Heal me. Ooh, ho, 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 ho. Dude got rocked. Also, let me get some of that sweet healing. Four more, huh? They don't even drop anything. He's gonna charge me. Come to me, champion. And together we will face it. Arden wield me. Hmm. Should we know who these people are? Their anima will Gorak Zar. Like, the Drust were a real race that existed in Drustvar, and then the Kul Tirans, like, beat them out, right? Like, that's what their lore was? Or have they always been undead monstrosities or creatures of darkness? I know they've always been creatures of darkness, but they've always just been, like, witches. It's just black magic. But all of a sudden, like, I don't know. This shit doesn't make any sense. Oh shit, it's Filiar the Destroyer. Ooh. Okay, could you like not do that? Oh my god. The wild sea. It's being hurt. Take it down. Quickly. Before we lose her. Lose her? Who is she? Mm, cut to death. Alia, look. What? Oh no! The wild seed. I no longer sense its dreams. Unless we save her soon, she will be lost forever. It's quite a big seed. In nature. Who are you? Are one. Be gentle. She's almost oh, gone. This should be interesting. I am ready to go. I once said that your voice is but one bird singing in the night. Well, I think it's time we all sang with you. You're talking to me or you're talking to the, the seed? I mean, as far as endings go, this one was one of the better ones for sure. This was a fitting end to this song. Uh... The power of music. Because if the shit was just like EDM music or fucking like muted, it doesn't hit the same.
Yeah, most people don't care about shit like this. Only if they're forced to do it the first time around. Sorry, it's only because I have 10% increased movement speed. Feline Stomp is a pretty cool ability, I guess. Looking back on our experiences here in the wield. What is this you bring us? Here to play serious, more tricks, or are serious Hedge? matters at hand. We request an audience. Need to let me finish saying it. We stalk the moonless no. night for Queen and Grove. Music is so good. I'll even take the road to be more RP efficient. Mm. Now it's just back to regular art and real music, though. 